Big day is a super Sunday, and we are ready for the super clash. That's a beautiful view of the Independence Square of Ghana leading up to the Accra Sports Stadium. The venue for this big game here at the Accra Sports Stadium is Kumasi Asante Kotoko up against Accra Suffolk. That's a beautiful scene leading up to the game. Really, it's a beautiful one. Usually, this, this part of the capital would have been packed with cars and filled with lots of vehicles. But on today, where the stadium is empty because of the pandemic, it is in an empty stadium. But it's a compelling fixture that is to come. An absolutely compelling fixture here at the Accra Sports Stadium. It's the biggest rivalry in Ghana football. It's a fixture everybody has been looking forward to. And it doesn't come any better when these two teams are trying to find their rhythm in the wake of their own controversial circumstances within their camp. Mass resignation sitting out of work, going four games without a win. They got a stopgap coach who has steered them to two wins in a row. Kotoko exited Africa, shifted their focus in the Premier League, got their game against the Chem United reined up. So what it means to them. And we'll find out today if all the trouble that has happened with Hearts of Folk would be any up front and Fabio Gama steps in to replace problematic for Kotoko's very Super clash. Hearts of Oak away to Kotoko in their own territory. Sell on our blessed whistles. Game underway. Welcome. This is Star Times at the part channel 247. It's a super clash. Kotoko, Hearts of Oak here is Sack. Enterprising left back. He finds Fabio Gama. This is Asante Kotoko. Kwame Poku goes down in the box. Penalty. And Nuru Sula will be asking questions of Yao Bless. That's whistles. Kwame Poku. Poku! Nope! Goalkeeper Richard Atta grabs it. Trouble if those full backs tell off forward and they are protected. This should be a goal. Obin Jr. What was he thinking? But Mubarak Yosef has been left off the hook. Huge touch. Now supporter Obin Jr. Trying to take on the goalkeeper, but the goalkeeper read the situation well. Stepped off the And Abela, lovely turn. Jemfi. And Abela is interested in the run. Yes, he goes forward. Pass from an Abela. Nabi Keita's effort goes wide. Manaf. He's got a bean junior to the middle. Razak to the left. Lovely skill from Patrick Razak. He skips past Nete. Razak again. Patrick Razak. Goalkeeper from Abalora, but hey, Razak had a bin junior in the middle. He had Manav behind him. He decided to go for Razak. Not particularly the best of touches, but Nete had committed himself. Went past Mubarak as if he wasn't there. Difficult for him to pick out that pass to a bin junior from here. I mean, his left is not his strongest side, so maybe you could have used his left right there to hit it. Still went with his right. Just couldn't generate the power he want. These are the games you need to be showing up, and that whistle go. The first half is over to go for the second half. Here we go. Obuka. Yes, he goes for goal. Just over the top. Ted Nana was looking to catch him into. And he drifted into the middle areas. Sweet pass from Manav to Patrick Razak. And he's got a first goal. An unbelievable miss. Patrick Razak. And Patrick Razak hit that ball across the face of goal. Trying to catch the goalkeeper on the far side. Again, just lovely pass from Sarkodia to Nete. That's what to find Jeffy. Nabi Keita! Good goalkeeping from Richard Atta. It was direct, but he had it well covered. Again, it, it had only one thing on his mind. Lining that one up for a shot. Straight down to the goalkeeper, Richard Atta. I don't think Paul. Here is Fatal Mohammed. Switches one each side. Abalora comes forward with a penalty. Is that touch? Is the Austrian leg of Razak Abalora that catches the striker? There you see the referee points to the spot. I think. Pass the ball. He steps forward. Abalora saves. Abalora has saved the penalty. Take a look at him. His head is down. He's not seeing the goalkeeper. He just kicked the ball. And now Razak Abalora. on that occasion. Audacious attempt from Isaac Mensah and it goes wide. He's trying to cut the goalkeeper from there. It's a difficult skill to execute. Right up to the roof of the net. Yeah. 
There you see it was trying to sort of go before the line, was thinking with catching, just couldn't master the skill to trouble the goalkeeper from there. Here is Jemfi, he's got Kwame Poku in the middle. Jemfi sends across, Kwame Poku! Good goalkeeping from Richard Atta, well covered. Good reading of the situation by the bigness because that was by accident that it came off Kwame Poku there. He had to be alert, watch it all the way and make the save. Yeah, it wasn't the most powerful of connections. Beautiful pass. Yes, Fabio Gama. Fabio Gama. <laughs> Asante Kotoko in the half, in the 80 yard box of Aston. Anabila. His effort goes far and wide. It's a goal kick. That's. Crystal to his mouth. He's blown it. It's over. Hatsabok and Kotoko, highly entertaining game. We didn't get any goals, two missed penalties, clear cut goals, current opportunities flapped, and in the end, it's Kotoko nil. Hatsabok nil in the super clash at the Akraspo Stadium.